Hello friends, welcome to my channel, a channel for learning simple coding. If you find this video to be helpful, please like, share and subscribe my channel. In the last video, we have seen that how we can use flat list component to display list of information in column and rows format. And in the last video, we have a one problem here that whenever we click here, we do not have any response because these are not a button so we will convert this into the button whenever we click on these item it should display the rank of the country like this we have a dummy rank so i click on this it should display rank so how we can do this that we are going to learn in react native using expo go so for that what i do uh, this flat list i will display under touchable opacity you see we have touchable opacity like this so i cut this and i paste all uh, this under this save this so you see that automatically we have this so i put this under touchable opacity this touchable opacity will convert all the items all the text items into a button whenever i will click it will perform the click event for that we have on press event so on press event i need to handle i say handle press this function and this function i will pass some information that's why i will use it like that so here i will pass information so that information uh, would be so I will put under this render not outside this because I need to pass information so I need to pass under this and then touchable I will use after that here okay why because I need to pass this item value here so this information I pass if I want to pass rank so I will pass uh, rank here like this I save this so this rank information I have if I want to pass name then I can pass name here now uh, I need to create this function so I say here uh, in this after this here I say const I say handle press then I have this function like that and I have a variable I say rank and I use alert component of this I say alert of react native dot alert here I pass uh, rank information and here I pass rank like this and I save this you see I done this now I try to click here you see rank one it coming information rank 5 you see then France rank 3 information is coming right now here so just because of this touch touchable opacity if in place of rank I want to uh, display name so I just pass name here and I say here uh, that is uh, name I convert this to name and and i say uh, i say uh, here uh, i make it blank no need of this and here i say you clicked on like this save this and i click here you see you clicked on usa so i can give a space here also save this then i say click here france so you clicked on france you see you clicked on israel you see you clicked on sweden so like this way uh, we can make this list as a touchable and responsive just we click here and we have the information that we want to store if we want to insert this information in database or some item i want to delete that i can also delete how i can delete for that we have to convert this all information into state variable because dynamically we can change only 
by state so what i can do here uh, i create here if i want to delete so i say here that const uh, i say country i say here country and i say set country like this i say use state so here in use state uh, i will uh, put all this information i just cut from here uh, like this i just cut it from here and i paste it here and i remove this from here and uh, this is country and i remove this from here and i save this and uh, you see and i click here once again this is working no problem at all but i want to remove the item when i click on this so for that uh, what i do here in place of name i pass id this way save this and uh, so you see that i pass here id in this way and i convert this into state variable now i have to remove the item just by clicking on this so i make it comment now and i name to i convert to id and then i need to set country and this country i will say country dot filter and in this filter function i need to pass here i say item and i say that item dot id is not equal to id so this id should not be there save this and you will see that when i click here so it, this item will remove i click here this item will remove click here this item is removed you see like this way we can remove dynamically so this way we can make this uh, you can say flat list touchable also we can remove item we can display information whatever we want so such kind of things we can do by using touchable opacity component that's all in this video i think you learn how you can make it touchable by using touchable opacity component in react native expo go if you like this video please do subscribe thank you for watching this video